Hello guys, welcome to YBUFR, the ERP channel for small and medium sized business. Today I will speak about Odoo and specifically about Odoo version 9 backend themes. I was um, made aware of a new backend theme by the company 8 Cells. They have just released the material backend theme for version 9. I had already tested the material backend theme for version 8 and at the time I found it uh, quite nice but nevertheless it would be too expensive with 150 euro. So now the first thing that I noticed is that the price is now 99.99 euro so the price is from my point of view quite reasonable if it brings what uh, I'm expecting them to bring. So the first point is well done with a price that is uh, lower. But I also noticed that other people are working very hard on backend themes. Company Devza that has proposed one blue backend team and a limitless uh, backend team. It means there that you can customize um, the backend team. So I will first go on to the material backend team to check what we have there. All the time I'm speaking about how beautiful Odoo has done the interface, but this new nice beautiful interface is only if you have the enterprise contract. If you just want to have the enterprise contract for the interface, it might not be interesting enough. For 99 euro, you can have this backend interface that looks as nice as the other one. For instance, if we look into the customers, this is uh, the material backend team. And if we do look at exactly the same things, the customers from Odoo, we have something that is quite similar. So I would say, uh, if you look a little bit into it, you see that they really have taken the ideas of what Odoo has done and they put their own fonts. You see the fonts is a little bit bigger. I also like the way they have done the buttons. This, uh, they put their own the stuff in it, you know, like their own touch in it. So I must say, really to be able to have all this new functionality from Odoo, so nice, nicely done for 99 euro, I find it's a very, very good price. So I'm quite happy with this. And um, I can only encourage uh, people who want to have the version 9 and have, want to have the new interface to, to check this out. But they are not the only one who have proposed uh, new themes. And what I would like to have a look on is the blue backend theme that is free by Devza. So let us have a look at it. If you want to have your old way of working, to have the sales menu here, you have it. Uh, I would say this um, auto blue back end brings the nice feature that we have now with Odoo, you know, this um, this nice view that we have with Odoo. It brings um, some of the layout that uh, Odoo, Odoo has brought and um, it keeps the, the, the menu on the left, what is quite interesting for most people. I really like the fact that you can open and close the menu because you really can use the full, the full screen. The last that I want to have a look on is the so-called limitless backend. It should be something where you can have much more functionality to customize. Okay, here I don't see the functionality to customize because probably you need to to be um, uh, administrator. But what is uh, very nice is that now you can have here small icons for the menu and it makes it much, much less than it used to be. So let us go to contacts. And this looks uh, quite good. So to say all have uh, copied a little bit what Odoo has done, it's about having an interface that looks as nearer to the standard Odoo as possible. So both tools do this. I would say if I need in terms of colors, 
I'm not so much fan of this blue, so I would say I'd rather have this um, magenta. Um, and I prefer the the material back end theme. But uh, if uh, the limitless back end theme allows the customizing that they promise to allow, then it will be something else of course so it's just that you can have your own color themes i just need to believe what they are telling me but uh, i i wasn't able to to test it by myself anyway uh it is 159 euro i would say the fact that you can choose your own theme is um is really great and this is the reason why i would be ready to pay a little bit more so i find the price is at the higher limit of what i would be uh, ready to to pay i believe that um if the developer continues developing this theme and proposes uh, more colors then it would be much much more interesting because okay just the colors that are proposed now there are none of them where i would say yes great i would pay for it so i think there's still some work to be done on the colors on the from the graphical interface but i think it is already something that is quite nice so that was it for today i hope you enjoyed the show and i see you on the next show